Rivers, lakes, and seas, they're vital for sustaining life on Earth. But across the UK, there's growing concern for their health. This is partly because of storm overflows, which divert excess rainwater and sewage into our waterways during heavy rainfall. But what exactly are storm overflows? Why do they exist? And what is being done to protect our waters? This is Decomplicated. What are storm overflows? Storm overflows exist because most sewers in the UK serve two purposes. They drain both sewage and rain. This system sees rainwater from gutters and pavements flow into drains, where it mixes with dirty water from toilets and industrial facilities. Normally, it's transported to wastewater recycling centres to be treated, but during periods of heavy rainfall, sewers fill up fast. Storm overflows act as safety valves, much like the overflows in your sink and bath, and release excess rainwater and diluted sewage into rivers, lakes and seas. They prevent sewage from overflowing into our streets and homes, but people are becoming more aware and concerned about them. Why are storm overflows a problem? There are currently 15,000 storm overflows across England, but a growing population, an increase in heavy rainfall as a result of climate change, and the rising use of surfaces that doesn't allow rain to soak through, such as tarmac driveways and artificial grass, mean storm overflows are operating more frequently to relieve pressure on sewers. This means contaminated water is being released into our rivers, lakes, and seas, rather than passing through treatment centres. This could damage biodiversity. The UK government wants to eliminate 40% of storm overflow discharges into rivers by 2040, as part of the Storm Overflows Discharge Reduction Plan. What are water companies doing about storm overflows? There are several ways water companies can reduce their use of storm overflows. During excess rainfall, storm flows are being stored in attenuation tanks. This means they can be treated after a storm rather than being discharged into open waters. Treatment centers are also being enhanced to accommodate greater storm flows. Treatment can be added to discharge, including nature-based solutions such as reed beds. How do we reduce use of storm overflows? There are ways of reducing the amount of water entering the sewage system. Using a water butt and soak away in homes helps to collect rainwater. This option can also help in reusing rainwater at each property and is the most sustainable solution. Planning rules that require housing developers to incorporate rainwater capture as part of new developments will be key to rolling this out at scale and relieving homeowners of additional costs. The UK must modernise its ageing sewage system to meet 21st century expectations. To do so will require cooperation between multiple parties, including the government, the environment agency, water companies, housing developers and communities, so that we can help to ensure the UK's rivers, lakes and seas thrive.